guys. I'm so excited to be with you again. So this week, I'm just going to give you a few ideas or basically an insight on what I carry with me on a daily basis um, in my bag. So we're going to start. So obviously, first and foremost, you need your wallet. I obviously told you guys about this before, my Chanel wallet on chain where I can wear it depending on where I'm going. It can wear it like with a strap, with a chain, or I can just uh, tuck the chain in and wear it as a clutch. So on a daily basis, I'll just use this as an actual wallet, a functioning wallet. Um, again, I mentioned that I got this on our honeymoon. So it's also something very sentimental that I like to carry with me to just remind me every so often of, oh, I remember when I got this. So yeah, I'm starting off with this. So next I have my iPhone. We cannot live without our phones on a daily basis. It's, it's literally our lives, our computer, our Bible, everything is in this. So yeah, I take this with me instantly everywhere. Even in the bathroom, we all take our phones with us. I mean, some of us do, right? So uh, anyway, it has this beautiful Lumi case on it. And when you want to take those good selfies and you look snatched, use your Lumi. It will not let you down at all. Then I'm going on to my Yves Saint Laurent sunglasses. I cannot live without these, you guys. You know, even when it's not even a, a, a sunny, sunny day and you it's just gloomy out, I still want to look fresh and cool, honey, because I, I just put these on. So, yeah, look at these. These are actually the same sunglasses that Kim Kardashian has, and I think a few other celebrity celebrities have these. Um, they're black, they're sleek, they're flat at the top. And they look really good on my profile, so I just take these even on a, on a really casual day if I just want to have my, you know, my makeup or my makeup really simplified and my hair very simple, I'll take these and add to it to give it more of a, you know, a zhuzh look. Not to mention that the case that it comes in is actually stunning on its own. Nice goal detail there. Same around. So if you're actually running to the store really quickly, you can just put your cards right in here with your sunglasses and you're good to go. Next, I'm going to throw in my Invisalign case because I need these when I take my Invisalign out for when I'm eating during the day. I, um, I need to have my case with me at all times. Nobody wants to take their trays out and put it in a tissue. That's gross. It always gets stuck to the tray. So yeah, we don't want to do that. Then I'm gonna grab my Swarovski pen. It was actually um, a wedding gift, but I take it with me everywhere because it has these beautiful crystals in there. Look at that, you guys. And the Swarovski detailing. So when I'm out and about, especially during you know my meetings, and I wanna have a decent pen to take out, not just some raggedy ballpoint pen. We all know the blue ones that everyone has. I don't do basics. So anyway, this is what I like to carry. And it comes in this, this um, really luxurious uh, I guess like a velvet case so very upper scale I like that and then sometimes my husband doesn't really know that I steal his watch and I will pop it out on occasion so I will take one of his Breitling watches and just wear it to be honest with you I mean if it fits if it works why not I just sneak some of the links out or whatever and um yeah, I'm just going to slide it on so you get to see what it looks like. Yeah, I can get away with it when I'm wearing like a big bomber jacket with a big sleeve so you can't really tell that it's not a women's watch. But it looks really um, gaudy, but not too much, you know? Just a little bit of bling. So we've got that. Then I'm moving on to a few makeup products that I must have with me at all times. I'm going to start with two things, actually. My Jeffree Star um, Velour Liquid Lipstick. And this is in Celebrity Skin. Like, I love this. I cannot live without it. It's matte. So you won't get any um, weird creases or, like, super dry lips. It's just, it keeps it really moist, and that's why I like it. And um, the color is nude. You can wear it at any time. So I must have this at all times. And then if I want to just go on from, you know, a regular day wear tonight, if I'm going to see a friend of mine for a quick bite to eat in the evening, I'll just add my Charlotte Tilbury um, lip gloss over top. And I think this one is, well, some people might say Ibiza. Some people will say, no, it's Ibiza. So it's Ibiza Nights. And yeah, I love this. It's really, really creamy. But you know how some lip glosses may leave your 
lips feeling sticky and tacky. It's actually not like that at all. It has actually like a, like a moisturizing, I guess, I'm not sure, like an element to it that allows it to just be smooth all day and not cakey. And I can't stand when you get the cakey lip with the white line. That shit's gross. Um, moving on, I have another choice of lipstick. This one is from my Tom Ford collection of three that was one of my gifts over the Christmas break. And um, this one is, uh, I think it's called Alexander, number 82. Um, again, it, it comes in three, but this one's my favorite shade. It's really creamy. And again, it's a nude look. So nude is totally my thing. I, I'm not really like a poppy, bright, vibrant girl. Maybe that was like two years ago for me, but today I'm just very neutral, monochromatic. And then I'm going to pull out another, my concealer. Listen, we have those times where your makeup might wear off in the day, but I swear to you, I don't even know why I really carry it. Just, I guess, if something traumatic really happened because this lasts all day from the more, the minute I wake up and I take a shower, I wash my face or whatever, I put this on and it lasts all day, you guys. One layer of this and you're good to go. It will not smudge. You can go from eight o'clock in the morning straight until midnight and this shit will not will not wear off. It's, it's really good, you guys. So I, I will not leave without this because I feel like there can always be that one moment <laughs> if, God, if God forbid, like a bird poops on you and you're like, what the, how am I gonna fix my makeup now? So you got this, lifesaver, lifesaver. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mac. Okay, people ask me all the time, so what eyeliner do you use? I love your wing liner. This, I live by this. This is like a part of the grail, okay? If you want a nice wing tip liner that doesn't have that weird gloss over top and you want a nice matte finish, and I mean a real matte finish, not semi-matte, nothing. This is the one to grab. It's the MAC Boot Black Liquid Liner. And um, yeah, just, just go and pick yourself up some. It's really good. And it's my staple, a part of my signature look. So, you know, we don't want to copy anyone's look, but we do want to make sure that we look presentable. And this is, this is my go-to. Who, who's here? My parents. Are you, are you kidding? No. Say your bye, Dauphines. Okay, Dauphines, it was great. Thank you so much. I really appreciate everything you've done. Oh, oh God. I really appreciate you guys watching this video. So like, over, subscribe. Babe. Start it over. Mommy? All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. So just like and subscribe and comment and let me know what you put in your bag every day with you. And yeah, see you next time. Bye. Bye.